My name is Elijah Shaw, and I'm the CEO of Icon Global, an executive protection consulting firm. For the past 31 years, I've worked on a full-time basis with a number of high net worth individuals spanning a variety of sectors, from corporate executives to your favorite celebrity's favorite celebrity. And while COVID-19 is the current virus on everyone's mind, depending on where you're going in the world, there could be several needed, ranging from hepatitis to typhoid to malaria. Circling back to coronavirus, that's a hot button topic these days, but I'm here to tell you that no matter what your political, religious, or ethical objections are, as protectors, we're gonna to have to deal with the reality that some countries are gonna refuse entry without the vaccine. Let's cut to the chase when you speak a foreign language. The ability to do so is gonna set you apart and make you more marketable for executive protection assignments abroad. My recommendation is to spend as much time practicing diplomacy as you do practicing with firearms. It can pay as just as many dividends in the long run. And since I brought up firearms, let's switch to the topic of hard skills. In the US, the expectation is that close protection agents achieve a high degree of proficiency with firearms. And while you can count on one hand the number of gunfights that the Secret Service has been involved in while protecting the president, clients still expect us to know how to run the gun. And quite honestly, it's better to have one and not need it than need one and not have it. First getting the proper skills and then experience working in international assignments greatly increases your marketability to potential clients. Hard skills save lives, but soft skills get you paid. The Executive Protection Master's Class, the one place where you can learn skills from the best in the industry to take your career to the next level. Join us at executiveprotectiontrainingday.com. Let's make this year the best year of your executive protection career.